What's up everybody, I hope you all are doing great and the topic of today's video is Biteable animation tutorial for beginners. So here we are on Biteable.com, they provide us the opportunity to use their online video editor, we can even use it for free. So in order to get started we need to visit Biteable.com, this website here. And let's click on get started or if you have an account you can just simply click on log in. And we'll come to the next page, basically this is our dashboard, let's have a quick tour. In the left side we have a home where we can find all of our projects, also we can discover some templates. On the templates area we can find all the templates divided into different categories. As you can see there are a lot of different categories we can easily use. Also on the projects folder we can manage all the projects we have. On the assets we can find all this stuff uploaded to this platform and on the brands we can easily try to add some branding info but it's only for paid plans and for the huge teams basically. So let's go to templates to find some animated uh, templates we can easily use and as you can see we can uh, choose the format, we can easily switch from horizontal to vertical to squared to Instagram size like a post or something like this. Uh, in my case I'm going to use a horizontal format because I'm going to create video as for my YouTube channel. So as you can see there are a lot of animated templates we can simply use, it depends on our video theme. So I'm going to find something which is suitable as for me, so let's try to use maybe marketing template. So I'm going to select a marketing category right up here. And as you can see we have like this video which is pretty interesting maybe as for the ads or something like this. So let's try to use maybe this one here. As you can see it's like totally free, there are a lot of free templates we can easily use. But uh, sometimes the templates should, could be paid, so we need to pay some money. Let's try to find something maybe which is more interesting, maybe this one here. So as for me these uh, two templates are pretty cool but uh, maybe we'll try to find something which is more interesting, maybe this one here. So let it be, for example, I think we need to choose um, this template here. So let's click on preview to view how does it look like and as you can see it looks like this. We have the music and we have this uh, sense here. So I'm going to click on edit this video and uh, we'll come to our editor basically. From this page here we can easily interact with all this stuff. And let's also have a quick tour. In the left side we can add some elements. We have some types of sense. We have basic, media, words, background. So these templates are also include different details. For example this one here has like image here, uh, text. Uh, every part of the template is customizable, so we can just simply add the template, add the sun, and then just um, you know customize it as we need. On the styles area, which is pretty cool, we can easily change the color palette. So the first thing I'm going to do is just to try to change the color palette. So let's try to click to find will something change. So also we can change the font. Uh, group but as you can see it's now bugged a little so let's try to use maybe this stuff here and the ribbon color let it be like this one here and the background I'm going to use is this one. So as for me it is pretty cool and it looks uh, pretty good. So you can do the same and I honestly suggest you to use this style uh, folder to customize your template for a huge like in a huge amount of parameters so it will be easier as for us to you know customize all the templates so let's click on edit and we'll come to our editor the main editor here here we can find the timeline where we can find all the uh, templates all the sans so we can easily interact with our sans by simply clicking on them right up here and also yeah you know, we have a player where we can find all the where we can find all the basic details, we can easily click to interact with them. And also in the right side we have a properties area, from this page here we can easily uh, manage all this stuff, we can change parameters, change properties of different details. So let's try to edit this uh, video, for example I want to create a um, preview for my YouTube channel. So firstly I want to delete this sand here, so I'm going to click and click on delete to try to delete this sand. Basically, is it possible as for me? Let's try to find. Uh, we can click on this arrow and let's click on delete send. So now we only have two ascents here. 
So the first, this girl looking for something. And after that, uh, this girl is just finding the solution or something like this. So uh, firstly, I want to edit the first sign here and change this text. So I want to click and then I'd like to highlight. And here we need to add something like this. Uh, try to try to find good tutorial. Try to find a good tutorial. Also, I need to change the duration, decrease it. So only for like, as you can see, two seconds. Uh, and here I'd like to add like a helperman. Helperman is here. So now I need to select this uh, text and I want to edit it for a little. Firstly, change the alignment to the central part. I also like to make it maybe change it to the high uh, register and I want to increase the size right here and also change the position. So now I'd like to make it maybe black to make it like really bold, like italic. So let it be like this. And also I'd like to decrease the decrease the sun duration. So now we have something like this. Uh, basically, we need to increase the duration because we have the animation of this girl. So we need to wait until it will be like this. So now um, our basically ready animated video looks like this. Yes, I think it's pretty cool. And uh, so we want to make it like five seconds duration. And now our video looks like this. Uh, also, I'd like to change this uh, soundtrack so we can easily delete it if it's necessary. But I want to basically, yeah, I want to delete, but we can easily replace the soundtrack here. So we can just simply choose it on our timeline, click on replace soundtrack and then just uh, change the music. So all of them are, um, I think that all of them are copyright free, but we can also upload our own music from this page. So I'm going to delete, click on more and delete soundtrack. And now our video is like without music, only the animated part. So now it looks like this. Yeah. Uh, and now let's click on uh, basically in order to in order to export this stuff, it just simply needs to click on uh, upgrade and then just upgrade it. As you can see, we have like pro version teams, $49 versus 99 and after that we'll be able to unlimit uh, the a lot of different HD exports so I think it's pretty cool that we can easily try it for free and after that we can upgrade and export our videos so this is a way of how can we create animated videos on biteable.com hope this video helped you out please leave a like comment and subscribe I wish you a very good day goodbye